now because Cantero has made some interesting um, accusations for which we're level me personally. I want to state for the record I have lived in HMOs. I've lived in rented houses that weren't HMOs. I currently live in a house in my ward in a street that is mostly rented accommodation. I do not vote for the amendment out of self interest. I voted for it because it's the right thing to do. And so I seem to be suggesting that none of us on this side know anything about HMOs. And for the record, I have lived in HMOs in Cambridge and elsewhere. I've been the resident landlord of um, HMOs in Cambridge and elsewhere. And when I got married, I kicked out the tenants and my house became a family home again. This is perfectly normal for a And I've also been the absentee landlord of HMOs in Cambridge. I've said it once, but I'm up in Council Road, obviously, didn't, listen, didn't hear. I won't say didn't listen, didn't hear. There are different de definitions of, a, of houses of multiple occupancy, but most of those that we would count as shared housing are inspected by environmental health officers, particularly for fire regulations. And when he suggests, Mr. Mayor, that it is a completely unregulated market, a completely without, landlords can do exactly what they like. <laughs> He is actually factually <coughs> incorrect. That's a Martin Day say. I don't think there's anything more to add. I mean, uh, uh, just to echo uh, Councillor Hurd's point that, that um, uh, Councillor Bonoski's uh, amendment has uh, a great deal of merit to it, although it doesn't go um, quite uh, far enough. But I think the difficulty is that the um, adopted amendment from the government uh, contains the usual um, do nothing, everything's fine, um, and uh, it's six months of the right side administration. Hmm. Uh, now, for the I'm afraid to communicate it too late. Uh, yeah, right. Uh, but can, can, can yeah. I put the um, motion to the vote, please? Those in favour of the motion as doubly amended.